Good morning, everyone. Happy This Is Real Life Thursday. I'm Drew Vaze, the founder of Shiny Happy Human, and I'm here on a mission to help mothers reclaim their identities as women so they can show their kids what is possible. And today, we're going to be riffing a bit about self-care, um, not as another thing to check off your to-do list, but the deep self-love that is crucial to actually enjoying your self-care. So a lot of the women that I work with, they say, I know I need to take care of myself, but I don't know how. And while in my Reclaim You program, which actually launches in January for the second time, we go through all of the different things that you can do to practice taking care of yourself. There's this fundamental piece that needs to happen first that we always talk about, which is you have to believe that you are worthy of taking care of yourself. You have to believe that you deserve to be taken care of. And that is often the missing glue. So a pedicure is all well and good, but if you're going and you feel guilty the whole time and you don't think that you deserve to be there and oh my gosh, I spent this money and I'm so selfish, don't even bother getting the pedicure if that's your like pathetic attempt at self-care. And I say pathetic lovingly because we've all been there. We all do it. This is a mommy mindset trap. And so I want to let you guys know a quick way to reverse it. So think of your best friend in the world, her birthday. Maybe you did something really special for her birthday. Maybe you bought her a really lovely gift or you surprised her with a visit or treated her to dinner and a show or an experience. And she was probably thanking you and saying, thank you so much. Like, you're so generous. What did I do to deserve all of that? And your thought process probably was, you deserve it because you're an amazing friend. I just love you for who you are. You're a wonderful human being. And while it's easy for us to recognize that in our best friends or somebody that's really special in our lives, when we have to turn that lens back on ourselves, we don't believe it. And so, um, like I said, if you're going to get that pedicure and you don't believe that you deserve to get that pedicure because you don't think that you just are an amazing human being and, and worthy of joy and love and relaxation, then it's not going to make a difference in your life. And so the thing that I want to work on is every morning before you open your eyes, I want you to close your eyes and think about your beautiful child or children or maybe you're pregnant and they're in your belly or maybe you haven't even had kids and you know you're going to have kids and um, just say these words to yourself. My child or children is worthy of love and joy and fun and so am I. My child is worthy of love and joy and fun and so am I. Because the best way for us mothers, we get such tunnel vision and we just want to take care of our kids. And we know that our kids deserve to have it all. Our kids deserve so much fun and adventure and all the gifts in the world. And so do we, for the exact same reason that our kids do. So just taking some of that love that we give to our best friends and we give to our families and turning it on ourselves. And then plan your day. Figure out what you're going to do for yourself because... You are enough. You are worthy of love and joy and fun and self-care and, and adventure and you deserve to have it all. But until you believe that, you're not going to reap the benefits of a self-care practice. So just some tangible, quick advice for you today on This Is Real Life Thursday. I hope that has served you in some way. Let me know um, some of your self-care practices below. We are always looking for more little nuggets of wisdom from other mamas. There's like so many different ways you can take care of yourselves, but sometimes we tend to hit a brick wall. So please share that below in the comments and uh, get on the list if you're not at shinyhappyhuman.com opt in so you can get information about our next class of Reclaim You. It's a course for new mothers who want to reclaim their identities as women and it is awesome. There is like sisterhood. It's eight weeks long. There's tons of guest speakers and bonuses and gifts and it's really a project that's really near and dear to my heart. So I would love to see you there. Get on the list to be the first to know when enrollment opens and um, take care of yourself today. All right. Bye guys. Love you.